Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Costco haul for the month of August. Well, I guess month of August and September. It's August 8th today and it's a Thursday. My kids start back at school on Wednesday of next week and my husband and I start back to work on Friday. So I wanted to get stocked up on just a bunch of stuff um, for the freezer and the fridge and um, ideally just not have to go do a big grocery shopping for a while. Um, I actually had, I was by myself and so I filled my cart. So there was a few other things I still would have purchased, but I just ran out of room. Um, so I probably will have to go back for like a smaller, uh, shopping trip at some point, but let's just get into it. Um, we have the Cressy's buttermilk pancake mix. This is just nice to keep in the pantry for like a weekend breakfast. Occasionally we do pancakes. Um, and you can also make waffles, I think, with this too. So we are out of it. We use the rest of ours this summer. So I thought I would grab a bag of that for the pantry. This um, refried beans, eight cans. Um, again, just to stock up. I'm gonna have to put stuff on the ground while I record this. Um, a container of head and shoulders. We're about like, we have about a third left of the head and shoulders that we're currently using. So I wanted to get stocked up on that. We got, let's see, set this stuff down. Um, the toilet wand and the refills. So for just again, our back stock of cleaning supplies. We got this huge um, pack of Clorox wipes. So there's five in here. And both of our kids require wipes in their school supplies. So I actually got another five pack um, a few weeks ago when I went to Costco, but one of my kiddos needs four and the other one just says Clorox wipes. So I'll probably send a couple packs to school with him and then keep the rest for the house. So needed some more of these. Um, a water pick, water flosser. So um, my nine year old wanted to try one of these for flossing. So I got this for their bathroom, as well as both my kiddos, um, I got them the Sonicare toothbrushes. So we have a um, nine-year-old and six-year-old, and I figured instead of just getting them the like character kind, I would just get them these nice ones from Costco. And um, yeah, I figured with one black and one white, they won't get them confused. Each of them can pick a color, and then they'll have an electric toothbrush. Um, some garbage bags over there on the floor that I need to put away. Let's see, feta cheese. We love this as the staple in our fridge. We use it all the time for things. Um, Greek gyros or salads, some bananas, some of this Mexican style cheese. I'll stick um, both of these actually in the freezer. They freeze really well. We have about a half of a bag left um, of grated cheese. So this will just, again, be a back stock. Organic pumpkin seeds. Um, these are great for uh, protein and also just to have for like homemade granola, to throw in homemade granola. Um, I know there's also like a recipe for Starbucks muffins that have pumpkin seeds on top. So I thought these would be fun to have. Some regular granola. Again, I'm gonna try to make some homemade stuff here soon, but this will get us through. Um, let's see. We've got some Uncrustables for the freezer that my six-year-old requested. Some of the carb balanced tortillas, we love that. The Oikos Greek yogurt, it comes with the vanilla, strawberry, and triple berry. That makes a really great quick breakfast with some of those granola. Uh, minced garlic, we always keep one of these in the fridge and we're just about out of our last one. This Belvita breakfast cookie. Um, there's little four little cookies in each pack, and again, that makes for a quick breakfast on a school morning. The soft and chewy granola bars, um, these no sugar added fruit roll ups. Uh, we've had these once before, but it's been quite a while, so I thought I would get those as a fun little after school snack or send it to school for their snack. Um, I found these Lolly's Organic Throat Soothing Pops for kids, so I figured with the start of a school year, um, these would be good to keep stocked up. We actually just got done having COVID as a family, but I'm sure like with the school year starting again, we'll get colds and all that stuff. So get those for the kiddos. Um, got the Toll House chocolate chips. They don't have the Kirkland brand anymore, but that's fine. Um, so that's just for our pantry. 
a two pack of the organic creamy peanut butter um, for the pantry. Dayquil and Nyquil just to stock up our medicine cabinet, as well as two of these um, bottles of Airborne and some Smarty Pants for the kiddos. This is the vitamin they've been taking recently, so I got another bottle of the vitamins for them. I was almost out of Italian seasoning, so I got a big container of Italian seasoning. Uh, let's see, the organic strawberry spread, we love that for jelly. Got some of the bite-sized creamer potatoes, love roasting those in the oven. We needed some craisins, we were out of those. We put craisins in our yogurt, or not in our yogurt, in our, um, what do we put them in? In our oatmeal. And then, again, if I make like a homemade trail mix or something, I could put craisins in that. Some hummus, some blueberries, they look delicious. Um, I just got a pack of the Venus razors for the shower. Um, Crest 3D white strips. This had the asterisk on it, and I'm not sure why. I hope that they wouldn't stop carrying this. So just in case I bought one of these packs, I have like half a pack of one of these left, but um, I love these things. So I figured I would get those while they had them. Um, the Force and Cheese. We love this on charcuterie boards, but I've also seen people make pasta sauces out of it. So I think I'm gonna do that pretty soon for a dinner. Um, put like one of these in the middle of a sheet pan with some tomatoes, cover it in olive oil, roast it in the oven, and then um, toss it, it'll get all melty and gooey, and then toss it with some cooked pasta. So I'll try that out. Tillamook cheese, we have one package of this already, but I'm gonna stick that in the garage refrigerator. Um, two big bags of this Kirkland whole bean French roast coffee. This is our coffee that we've been drinking and really enjoying two gallons of milk. I got four um, loaves of the oat nut bread. I'm going to stick all of those in the freezer because we have one out currently. I've got some of this naan. We love to keep this in the freezer. And again, it's just a quick either dinner with lentils or you can make little homemade pizzas on them. These romaine hearts. And then I got a bunch of Ziplocs. Let's see if I can show you here. So this is the gallon size Ziploc. Again, just to stock up, they were on sale. Um, some of these Kirkland chicken breast chunks. These are great to keep in the freezer. Some of the Kirkland pepperoni pizza. Some albacore tuna. Um, let me go over here for the meat. So we've got a two pack of the um, pork tenderloins. I cook those in the crock pot with either um, ch like chili verde sauce or um, barbecue sauce is great and then shred it up. And then I show you the tuna. I got a four pack of this ground turkey, a two pack of the frozen lasagna. Um, I got this cute little pillow that is a ghost. So that'll be fun for the holiday, um, for the, for like the fall season and Halloween. I got the pumpkin pillow last time I was there, but they didn't have the ghost one. So I'm excited to have that. Um, I got the salami, it's a two pack. My kiddos like this in like a homemade Lunchable or as a sandwich. The flautas to keep in the freezer, we'll do one of these as a dinner with some like refried beans and some Mexican rice. Um, these Amy Lou's caramelized onion aged white cheddar burgers. They're already cooked and you just like warm them up. Super good. Love this salad kit. Have gotten this many times over the years, but haven't had it in quite a while. It's the Chinese style salad kit and you just um, chop up lettuce. It doesn't come with the lettuce, but then it comes with everything else and it's super tasty. I got this pre-picked um, chicken, rotisserie chicken. So just for convenience to make enchiladas and probably another meal. Um, I'll probably split it in half and then freeze it and it'll be a quick, quick meal for a couple of nights. Some cottage cheese that we needed, two pack of ranch that we needed. Um, I don't think I showed these. So we got the Victoria um, marinara sauce that was on sale and then the two pack of the French coffee creamer just to stock up some string cheese. Down here, I've got the frosted mini wheats, the honey bunches of oats, the Premier Protein. We love putting these like in coffee to make an iced coffee. Use that as a creamer with a couple shots of espresso. 
And then this box of popcorners, it comes with four different flavors. There's 30 bags in total. So it has the white cheddar, the kettle corn, the spicy queso, and just the plain sea salt. My kids have really been loving the popcorners chips. Um, let's see, some bacon. I'll cut this in half and throw those in the freezer. I got two, three packs of the um, slice oven roasted turkey breast. So this is our preferred lunch meat. So I've got six packs of those to get us going on the school year. Um, we use these again on sandwiches. We roll them up with cheese. We cut them into like squares for homemade Lunchables. Got some red seedless grapes, some laughing cow cheese, some Driscoll strawberries. My nine-year-old asked for strawberries. I got two boxes of the sous vide egg bites. These are like the Starbucks dupes. So there's um, five, two packs in each box. And so I got two boxes of those. Those are an easy breakfast. My husband and I will like take these to work sometimes. Even the kiddos like eating them for breakfast. And then I also got a four pack of the quart size Ziploc bags, a case of green beans, um, a box of this almond, blueberry almond crunch, no sugar added cereal. And then a mixed pack of the Ziploc. It comes with the um, little snack bags, sandwich bags, and then a quart size and a gallon size as well. But I got this really for the snack, snack size bag and the sandwich bag. So that is what I got at Costco. Um, if you're new to my channel, I'd love to have you subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.